today is a wash day. I just took my sewing out. Here is my hair growth for right now. What it's looking like after my braids. I'm really hoping I didn't cut any of my hair, but I feel like I kind of did. Uh, taking out the sewing because it's shedding a lot. Like, a lot. Like, as if I cut it. So, alright. So, I'm going to be using the Rice Water Remedy products. And this is the Strengthening Conditioner. Strengthening Shampoo. And then, I'm going to also be using the Leave-In Conditioner afterwards. Moisturizing Milk. And then, this is uh, stimulate and restore um so this is later on down the line so i'm gonna go ahead and start washing my hair with this and excuse my voice i'm kind of sick um uh, but i'm just gonna get my get my water going and let's get started Okay, so right now I'm just going in with the conditioner and I do like to really massage this into my hair and into my curls and just kind of separate everything out and like finger comb everything. Um, right now I'm just pulling my hair apart in different little sections just to make sure that conditioner gets in there good because my hair has been in the sew-in for about two or so weeks and um, I also got in the pool in between that time so I wanted to make sure I was very well moisturized. Okay, it said let it sit on for about five to ten minutes. So I'm going to do just that. I'm gonna put a little bit more on my hair because I feel like it needed it. Look at that. It's giving noodles. I don't know if y'all can really see it, but I'm I'm really freaking loving it. Like you guys can like see my hair a little bit better. So I have my detangling comb and I'm just gonna go through it and detangle it while I have my conditioner in there. Um, and just kind of comb through it. As y'all can see, this is my hair length so far. Um, I've been growing my hair out for the past, it's almost been a year. Uh, November, I want to say November will make it a year. So it's been about eight. It's been nine months. Y'all came to see the hair, not me. How thick my hair has gotten. And just how long it's growing out. The middle and the, end, and the back of my hair has always grown longest, faster than like the front part of my hair. But even with growth from the front part, like I'm still fairly impressed, honestly. And then y'all can see like the back of my hair, how long it's growing. Lynn check, Lynn check, read all about it. And then these are usually like my sides. We're getting somewhere, y'all. Y'all, since I've been growing out my hair, this is my first time blowing out my hair and seeing how long my hair has gotten. I am all natural, no relaxer, y'all. And look at my hair. Look at my hair. I'm pretty sure it looks a mess back there. I am so tempted to cut my hair in a black cut right now and just rock out with my hair. Honestly, my ends do need to be cut really bad. So what I'm about to do, I'm about to go through, I just blew it out. I'm about to go through my hair and actually press it out and see what my hair is looking like from there. 
And then honestly, I I may give myself a blunt today. I do not know. I do want my hair to be long and healthy. I know if I cut my hair in a blunt cut by today, in a couple of weeks, my hair will be as good as in good condition, like at a good length. That I do know for a fact. But like I told y'all, the back of my hair always grows really, really long. So no matter how many times I cut it, it's like, I kind of want to wait because I want my blunt cut to be long. But we're going to see what we're going to see. Stay tuned for the rest of this video. I'm about to go get my shears. My flat irons are heating up. And I'm about to get a comb from out of my bag. And let's just see where this video goes. Okay, so right here, I'm just pressing out my hair. You want your hair as straight as possible, especially when you are natural. So that way, when you're cutting, you get a precise cut. Now, I haven't cut the back of my hair in such a long time. So when I actually did go in to cut it, it was like a little, it was a little um, tricky. It was a little tricky. But I did get the job done. I will say overall, after I cut it, it made my hair look a lot better um, and more healthier. So my hair should be growing really good from here on out. But I just wanted to at least show y'all what this haircut was given. And girl, check it out. So when I turn around, y'all can see how it's looking before I cut the back. A little uneven. Um, and then let's check it out after I cut the back of my hair. Um, y'all will see how much fuller it looks, how healthier it looks in the back. And it's really just giving. One day I'll do a full detailed video on how I actually do my haircuts on myself. My camera was actually dying a lot in between this time. So I can only give y'all what I could. But so far, I'm loving it. Alright, so after I did my haircut and everything, I went ahead and did me a protective style. Um, I tried something a little different. I may just do a hair review on the hair that I actually used in this video um, in another video as well. Um, I thought about doing separate videos, but I decided to go ahead and combine this and just make this a full hair day all together. Okay, um, I did use the protective, um, what do you call that stuff? The protective stuff that you put on your hair before you put the glue on. And then I wrapped my hair in the ponytails. I would not recommend putting glue on like this, but the glue top was broke. And girl, I had to do what I had to do. So, but don't be like me, be a little bit better. After I did all of that, I decided to go in with some crimps just to give the ponytails a little bit of oomph. Um, they were a little plain and I didn't want it to be completely crimped, but I did want it to have some sort of texture. That's why I'm not really going in too hard with the crimping irons. But I actually did love the way this style turned out. I'm not going to lie, in the beginning, I thought about rinsing this hairstyle out because of how the ponytails turned out i actually did it lopsided by accident but um all in all the hairstyle was cute it's giving i've been getting a couple compliments on it so far and it's a quick wake up and go style that i don't really have to worry about i just throw on my body and keep it pushing okay so you know i couldn't end this video without giving y'all like a full look and i was kind of rushing through my makeup while i did this so i will do like an actual detailed makeup look with this hairstyle but this is just the hair y'all i hope y'all enjoyed this video i will retry this hairstyle again and do it a lot neater um but this was definitely unplanned but still i love how it came out Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe and talk to you later. Yeah, you got my heart.
You know that you got me